Alright, today we're going to see if we can destroy this electric screwdriver. It's some cheap hover fray. I got this like for like five bucks. This thing was charged overnight and it's still not charged. So, once it's charged, we're going to do a torture test. Let's get it. First thing, let's see if it can actually unscrew something. I'm impressed. See if I can put it back in. Oh, dang. What a five dollar pool. That's so good, really. Let's really put it to the test. Got this three inch, three eighths inch spade bit. Let's see if we can get the fit on here. Alright, let's get a piece of wood. Pretty thin piece of wood. Alright, let's draw a hole out. It's my test piece. Grab some clamps. I didn't think so. I didn't think it would do it. That's about all it did. Battery's almost dead. Oh. Let's show you how real drill does it. Let's show you how a real drill is supposed to do it. Got my Milwaukee. This baby goes to anything. That's how it's done. <laughs> and this little bitty thing. Let's see if it can put down a, a quarter inch screw. A block of wood. A block of wood here. Got my screw. We gotta get a bit. I don't know, hook up. <clears throat> I'll be really surprised if this thing will actually go through this.
Harbor Freight Jump. I'll show you how a real one does it. That's how it's done. Impact. So, overall, this thing's really just for maybe a couple ladies hanging some pictures on the wall. And that's about it. Takes forever to charge. And look at this thing 4.8 volt cordless screwdriver. Dude, this thing barely works without the cord plugged in. So, I mean, you want crappy tools, go to Harbor Freight. You want quality tools, buy yourself some Milwaukee. About all it's worth, five bucks. It's a good deal for this piece of junk. Peace out.